It's 35 weirdest things ever caught on Squirt's camera. So you guys do enjoy, please drop a like, subscribe to my channel. And let's get straight into today's video. You can tell this guy enjoys his job. Look how he's handling the packages so carefully. Not. <laughs> Just imagine sitting back and washing your packages getting handled like this. What would you do? He forgot how road works. I think he forgot you also get oncoming traffic as well. The worker in the bottom right corner's reaction is priceless. So many emotions went through his body at the same time. He was thinking, what the hell have you just done? He just bought a bike from the showroom. Then he decided at the last second he doesn't want the bike anymore. I wonder why. Prodigally dropped it into the pool. When you work with total idiots at work, this happens. This worker lost his common sense that day. He thought he can roll this big wheel to work. But obviously he can't steer anywhere so it'll go into any direction. He forgot about that one. If you think you love your car, check out this guy. You won't believe what he did to his car floor. Just wait for it. Great tile work though, I'm quite impressed. This guy's shop motto is no need for tools and parts in my shop because he ends up using his head. Mm -hmm. I'm definitely heading to his shop. When one easy job turns into a bigger job, well it doesn't matter because they're getting paid a day rate. When it's your first day at lorry driving and you think it'll be fun until you get stuck down an alleyway like this guy did. He's maybe learned his lesson next time, never do shortcuts around a job. He was trying to save money instead of hiring a scaffold. Now he owes the customer a thousand dollar air conditioning unit. Well, at least we know this guy isn't too keen on snakes. It was only a pie between his legs. <laughs> If you're going to book a work trip with this guy, please don't book going to the zoo. After this, I don't think he'll like it. When you're told everything will be okay, but it's not. They told this guy they only need access to his place and it will not affect anything. Instead of watching TV now in the living room, he's got to look at pipe work. <laughs> If this was your home, what would you do? Please put your comments down below. When it's your last workload, so you're trying to get home as soon as possible, but it ends up going completely wrong. He's having a great day at work. After his shift, he ends up reversing into a digger. He was probably too excited that he's going home and forgot the digger was behind him. <laughs> that makes perfect sense. You end up hiring the machine and end up pushing the machine manually. 
When you're buying your first vehicle, but you end up buying a helicopter and using it on the road. <laughs> It was trying out the new lift car park for the first time. Well, it's safe to say that will be his last time doing that again. This tram thought it was a car for a second trying to join the road. What could literally go wrong? Well, everything. And the most impatient reward goes to this guy. He couldn't even wait for a gate to open. He couldn't afford a bus, so we end up putting two cars together. It's a great idea though. When you can't work without your best friend, me to you, me to you. I think these guys have one brain cell between them both. He was trying to outsmart the barriers without paying for a ticket. Now he's got to pay for a new wing screen. He won't be trying that again. He forgot to bolt the back of his truck up. Just wait for it. These workers show a tutorial on how they fix their cars. All they have in their workshop for parts is tape. This is the reason why. This guy was so generous. He even gave the customer a free paint job. And this next worker gave the road a free paint job. He forces car can hold anything. He literally if you did enjoy today's video, then hit or two of my other videos on the screen right now. And if you guys want to see any videos from myself in the future, then please subscribe to my channel. Enjoy and have a great day. I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace out.